It is pertinent to mention that as an itinerant prophet and evangelist of God, he has successfully spread the gospel of our Lord Jesus Christ to almost all the nook and crannies of Nigeria, West Africa, where the Lord has used him to establish many assemblies, which were later taken over by Christ Apostolic Church, CAC, till today. He has even crossed the seas to other countries and clans, notably the United States of America and the United Kingdom, to preach the gospel of the Lord. You will realize that Papa was given special assignments. I just want to mention three of them. He was not, he was not just a prophet on evangel, but he, he was endowed, just given assignments a lot of them are there are here but i'll just mention three of them one of the special assignments that was given is the establishment of koshimti prayer meeting which we all know can we put our hands together for jesus christ you remember recently it was 53 the 53rd anniversary of koshimti that we we celebrated in Akure. those of us who were there raise up your hand and wave your hand to the lord 54 54 Koshevti anniversary. After 54 years, the Koshevti is still waxing strong and strong and strong and strong and strong. And if you come to wax strong, because of his burning desire to work for God and attain a high level spiritual standard with God. He Obadari began a three-day fasting and prayers as God directed him. On the 29th day of December 1969, the run of the year, I told you that Baba will not do anything without asking God. It was customary of him at the end of the year, he will go and pray, asking God, What do I do next? In the coming year, what do I do? Where do I go? What step do I take? That was his habit, and he was doing that. So he began this prayer, and the session was to end up on 31st December 1969, the same year. An event occurred on the afternoon of the second day of, in the midst of eight people. He was among eight people fasting and praying, and something happened. What is it? he saw somebody standing by his side and the person called his name three times and inquired from him if he was ready to do the assignment he was going to give him during that conversation the following dialogue ensued the voice said are you ready to accomplish the great task i wish to send you and Baba answered, Yes, I will, if the Lord empower me to do so. The voice continued, My son, this assignment is very difficult and complex in nature. Will you be ready to carry the cross? He also answered, I will, if the Lord empower me to do so. The voice continues and said, well, the world is suffering because of sin. Sin, people of the world are afflicted by diseases and diverse sicknesses. This will tell you the reasons why Koshyoti was established. Those of us who don't know. Because of sin. And that people have been afflicted with diverse diseases and sicknesses. And, Lord, and he answered, he said, Sir, I will if you empower me to do so. Then Lord promised to establish through me a place of pilgrimage for people to converge, bringing their many problems which defy all forms of solutions. This the Lord promised to do because he said, is the Lord who never 
veils. That is how Koshimti was named. Koshimti, the Lord who never fails. Can you say Koshimti? The Lord who never fails. People will bring their problems to that place and I will solve them. Don't worry, just rely on me. The place for this pilgrimage I'll be called Oluwalon Koshimti. Translate to me the place of God never fails. The Lord directed me at the meeting shall be initially held on the first day of every month. Eventually to two days, rising to three days, eventually to four days, and finally rising to seven days before the second coming of our Lord Jesus Christ. How many days are we doing Koshimti now? How many? Five days. Which means there is still more to come. This is what the Lord told that before the second advent of our Lord Jesus Christ, Koshim the priority will become seven days. So, once we become seven days, come up for running hell. Yes, we fed in hell. Hence, prophet and evangelist T. Obada re established Koshim prayer meeting and had the inaugural meeting on the first of February 1970. That was the first Koshimti inauguration. First February 1970. The prayer is still in full force up to today. The second assignment God gave to Wasem and to give to Obadare as an assignment is Wasem. In the year 1974, the Lord directed Apostle Obadare to establish a group that will sponsor his evangelistic tours and campaigns to all parts of the world. This group was first named Wasek Group, World Soul Winning Evangelistic Group, at its initial stage. And this was on until 1975, before it came to Wasem, World Soul Winning Evangelistic Ministry. You will agree with me that the, 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 the ministry has now grown to a complex structural organ of evangelism. And uh, in the year 1979, this became A ministry to be reckoned with with Christ Apostolic Church in the year 1979 in CAC. And CAC termed was them as the evangelical arm of Christ Apostolic Church. The evangelical arm of Christ Apostolic Church. About the truth was them as we able to establish revival centers in all the 30 cities of Nigeria, almost all 30 cities of Nigeria. There are one seven revival centers in Ghana, Usugedia, in Liberia, Benin Republic, United Kingdom, Canada, United States of America, and every other part of the world. I thought you are going to, I, I think you are going to clap for Jesus Christ. For a man who could not see, Ah, somebody who could not see like I am seeing. He has taken the gospel to Canada, United States of America, Benin Republic, everywhere, all over the world. It's, it was always on the road, always. And the international headquarters of Wosem is at Akure. On those state, and this one is very close to my church, Christ Apostolic Church, Okitura Cathedral, Akure on those states of Nigeria. And the motto of the ministry is eagerness of God. Somebody say eagerness of God. Let me mention another one, another assignment that God gave to Baba. We call it IMA. I'm sure some of them will be here tonight, members will be here today. International Ministers Prayers Association, IME. 
Another important assignment was added to many, to many ones given to Obadare in 1987. It was called to inaugurate an international minister's prayer conference and seminars for Nigeria. This prayer conference is open to all interested ministers of God. Whatever they are called, it is an avenue where ministers of God come together to share experiences and rub mind together about the work of God and how best the gospel could be preached in order to Christianize the whole world for Jesus. IMA was also meant to assist the less privileged pastor, servants of God in their developmental process. Most importantly, this conference and seminars is meant to equip ministers of God on how to remove cultic and abalists approach to the services of God administration because it was observed at that time that many of the churches many of the ministers were still though they were covered they were still using other powers they still believed in all those things they were doing before and they were bringing it to the ministry so God now to that go and establish a place where people will come together to rob mind and to teach them how they should not get involved in all this. The inaugural meeting of the International Conference was held at St. James Cathedral, Okebola Ibadan, in November 1987. That was the first time the IME met, IME met. Several other subsequent meetings were held at Ilori, Abel Kuta, Akure, and Elisha. Of a far, the saying is true of Prophet Obadari, of whom he know he also predestined to conform to the image of his son. Romans chapter 8, verse 29 to 30. Now, let us see how people saw Obadari during his lifetime. I just brought few of them here. The Bible says, by the fruit you shall know them. Do men gather grapes or figs or trees too? Even so, every good tree bringeth forth good fruits, but a corrupt tree bringeth forth evil fruits. Every tree that bringeth not fruit, good fruits is hewn down and cast into the fire. Therefore, by their fruits you shall know them. Matthew chapter 7, verse 16 to 20. Now, among several known comments about the person and the mission of of Badari and his achievements one of them is that of uh sorry the mission of achievement dr t obadari as an african and a nigerian mostly a mostly revered servant of a living god all over africa one of them was Pastor Joseph Adegoroye, the late president of CAC worldwide. In 1985, he said, Prophet Obadare is a hero as well as a dynamic man of God whose knowledge is wonderful. He is a prophet of Christ raised to accomplish certain important spiritual assignments Bondering on salvation of souls, faith, setting the captive free, and healing in Jesus' name. That was the comment the CSC president made at that time. He further said, it is just because God desired peace for Nigeria that he raised evangelist and prophet of Badari for the completion of his work and the spiritual of the spiritual and healing of mankind according to the will of God. That's what one of the greatest testimony that happened from our, our, um, our daddy, that is the late president of CAC. Another one, late pastor and evangelist Dio Babajide, one time CAC general evangelist saw Badari as a great man of God sent to the entire world in the Wilson Monthly Magazine that we used to produce in those days, Volume 1, number 30, of June 1991, he said, 
I testify with strong conviction concerning prophet Obadari. Let all servants of God in this generation acknowledge the steadfastness and the inestimable prophet so that the showers of blessing from the prophet may come to reign in the second advent of our Lord Jesus Christ. Another comment was from a publication titled Prominent Builders, published in 1995. Obadari was described as an embodiment of power destined to live for a cause and is di divinely inspired. He is a born preacher who loves, who love, whose love centers on biblical counseling and prayers. You will agree with me. Baba was a great counselor. But I, I think you are going to put your hands together for this. In fact, I, 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 I happen to witness this. Each time we sit down to counsel people, Baba will start early in the morning. He will stay there until about 3 p.m. By 5 p.m. is there, he's there again until God knows when. Attending to people. Solving their problems. Number four. Jamen Onkruma, a non-Nigerian, described Obadari as one of the pioneers of PV evangelism in Black Africa, most populous country, as his well-known voice in various Nigerian radio stations. You will agree with me, Baba was the first Black Africa to start radio evangelism. You will remember. A castle, a brother, 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 a <laughs> Pastor Adeniro, a former organizing secretary of Wosem, I think I, I interviewed this book by myself, disclosed that Prophet Badare is an extraordinary man. He is an extraordinary man. Pastor Jare Lao, a former principal of Wilson, saw Badare as more of an evangelist than a prophet. Now, let's see the spiritual assignment that God gave him. Then we will stop. God gave Baba spiritual assignment. There are so many of them. I've just mentioned three, but I will read them out so you have them. It is a known fact that amongst the assignment the Lord bestowed to the hands of Badari, such as soul winning. Soul winning. Baba was passionate about souls. Beauty really. No, in fact, beauty really. More not in 2005, I Liberia. We were going, we couldn't get plane to Liberia. Baba said, eh, see, I'll read me. I'll let, Pastor Waludele, you can bear me witness. And if, the one we see is going to Syria alone, Baba. And Baba, she has the rock of Jew, Mitama, will not be Syria alone, like Los Liberia. Ah! Can't walk out, Jew, will not be Syria alone, Los Liberia. So, we are part of the logic here. Baba, we are not here. We are, Baba. Is, he was always burning for soul winning. And that one is healing and miracles. You all saw this. We can't, we, can't, we can't give evidences of them. There was a day he called me. He said, This 
this, this testimony I'm giving here, I know some people will know about it. We got home, he said, only what? Matthew. Baba we so yell. Only only back on what to get off wa. Only a only a ya. Only a wag be dancing. The what the Ewa lo bad raffum. Tara o ba ya, and my badawali. Ah, Mogura me. Baba, where the hell? Oh, yeah, the big like Lafeshi. True to God, because when we talk of the power God gave to Baba, it transcends and covers everybody around under Him. Before we go to any Ekameje, we go to the palace. The king and the bounty, Baba only Baba was shinle. Although the man was inside, he didn't want us to see him because he was sick. Baba, in that paro, I want ah. I could have let it wow. Our father is not a wow. Only a drone in Mumbo. He went inside. He brought Olori. And we told Olori that Papa Lonika Waki. Baba wow. Ah, only a da, only a drone. He went, he went inside and. To the glory of God. When she got to the place and said, I want my brother to come, 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 Juanita. But Bati Oti was lonely, Busuti Oti for so many years, for so many months. Only kill a week. Only I want my brother to hold on to me. Only a lonely man. Him, him, who? And he was coming. He was coming. He was coming. When my father was coming, oh, I fell. But I didn't ask him. Only your mother there, Anissa. Only boy there, where are you? Come on, Debe. Come on. Baba, Baba, where are you? Glad to meet you. Baba, my Baba, Baba, only one Baba, 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 Baba. So we just prayed. Instantly, the man rose up and he was healed. So he was given that grace of healing. The rest. Evangelism, church planting, prophecy, establishment of Benga Group, introduction of uh, an establishment of IMA, inauguration of international evangelism, pastoring, teaching. Oh, Baba was a great teacher. A teacher, a teacher of the Bible, a teacher, a teacher. Baba will stand and, and, and mention and begin to quote three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten verses on the same point. So, Baba, she can't kill me. Can't kill, kill, kill me, sir. Oh, read command by any. Oh my God. The Lord gave to him CAC as a mission. Kosciente prayer meeting in 1970. Who served as a ministry in 1974. When he was alive, he was given a, a, a number of uh, uh, awards of excellence. I've mentioned them. Apostle Pio Barare, through the work, through his work, was honored with many awards during his lifetime. Honorary doctorate degree from St. John's University, mission in 1985. Member of International Affairs Detachment Gold Permanent, Golden Gate University, Los Angeles. Honorary doctorate degree from Trinity College of Ministerial Arts, Imo State. When he was alive, he was the president of IMA till death. He was the president. Two, the executive director of the world's soul winning evangelistic ministry till death. Three, member of the APES Authority of Gen uh, and General Evangelist of Christ Apostolic Church world worldwide till death. And finally, Obadare was the second ordained apostle of Christ Apostolic Church worldwide. <laughs> Apart from Babalola, he was the second one. Well, let me just give you chronological events that I know. Obadare started Christianity 1st February 1970. Put that one down. Wosem, 1974. 
Below are some of the places where Baba Obadare conducted powerful crusades and planted churches. And what do you see? Number one, Okutipupa was in 1968. Akure Revival, 1969. Shaki Revival, 1970. Ilesh Abaruba, 1970. Ile Ife, between 1969 and 83. Elisha Revival, 1977. Igbora, 1979. Ibadan, that is Sango, 1979. Ileano Akure, 1980. Oh, Murukuma Kwadabu Jesu, Ah! Lagos, 1981. Kaduna, 1981. Kano, 1981. Zaria, 1981. Adwekiti, 1981. Gombe, 1986. Maiduguri, 1981. Ilori, 1982. Oshobo, 1984. Onya, 1984. Oyo, Bago. Bago, 1988. Onisha, 2005. Ikiru, 2005. Inisha, 2005. Ilarogo, Kanji, Agoare, and so on and so forth. This is where Baba Bada had the arrival. And he planted churches there. Like I said, also in Ghana, in Liberia, Paraku, Kilibo, Porto Novo, Europe, Canada, and the United States of America. He also touched all these places with revivals, and the churches are being planted there. Now, listen to this one. It is also on record that the entire region of Delta states of Nigeria all the entire region of Delta State of Nigeria, from Umusam, Utakogwe, Amai 1, Amai 2, Amai 3, Ashaka, Eborogo, Ugeli, Wari, and so on, were also liberated through the great rivers of Obadari. <laughs> ah! Well, all this clearly attests to the fact that God really called his servant to duty for this generation as over 300 churches both home and abroad were planted by apostle dr t o of padare <laughs> On a final note, with this careful look and the study of the life of time of Apostle Dr. T. Olubadari and his ministry, I hereby declare that Apostle Dr. Timothy Oluwole Obadari is nothing but a doyen and a generalissimo in the field of radical evangelism in the history of black Africa and the world at large. <laughs> Let all of us rise up on our feet. Bobo, aye, mama, mama. All you are mothers. One t-shirt here, up. Bobo, let it one so. That your messages are delivered. If I want so, ne yoba. That there was no transportation for yoruba. Bobo, until one so, na ne bi ikpeji bi oche bere ati bitode 
ati gbogbo ilu ti ipeji to jere okan a o fi alleluia meje seven alleluia a o fi ki baba yen ku se jesu oluwa ti pe o se o lori ipeji for this god ipe na to se gbogbo bebe yi lati owo iko re individual presentation ni eyo enikan kan yo ma mu ebun ti wa wa as many as we hear lowo owo gently and in orderly awo awo pe wa nigba to ba tu apo we be calling on us when the time comes isori akoko ti awo pe the first category of people we are calling for their gift o na ni obadare family is the obadare family Why are soft, 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 soft,
We can do better. We can do better. Okay, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Okay, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Every time you say okay, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Let's take our seat. It's anymore. I want to use this opportunity to thank God who made today a reality and met all of us in good peace that we are celebrating this Thanksgiving with joy. The merciful God will be with us. The God of Badare will continue to justify us in all our endeavors. God of Koshenti will not leave us. I want to appreciate our gift in cash. The Lord of all blessings will bless us. We will not suffer. And suffering will not be our portion. To spend will not be our difficulty. Things will not be tight for all of us. The merciful one will show his mercy on us. As you have made me happy today, you will all be happy. And you will all have sorrow. The God we serve will continue to be with all of us. After our endeavors, yeah. We not miss eternity after our devil here. We not miss the glorious home. Thank you so much. I'm grateful to all women. I'm grateful to all men. You all our fathers here present. And to the choir as well. Making all of us happy. We continue to be happy. We continue rejoicing. Thank you. God bless you. Yes, on behalf of the Obadare family, uh, we want to say a big thank you to Wasemites all over the world. We don't take this for granted at all. Uh, allow me to stand in for our general overseer and mommy Gio to say a big thank you. My wife and I and all the Obadare uh, children and the family at large, we truly, truly appreciate you, Wassamites. We weren't expecting this, so it's a surprise to us. But we pray that God will continue to surprise you with goodness and mercies. Honestly, from the bottom of my heart, I 
want to say a big thank you to all workers in Wosem. To continue this work, I'm sure it has been by the grace of God. You could have chosen to leave when our father passed on to glory. But you decided to stay. Because you were not worshipping our father, but you were worshipping the father that was inside of him. The one who called him, who never fails, and who never dies. Jesus Christ of Nazareth. We thank God for him, and we thank God for you. You know, our father's work also succeeded because you were there. So we thank God for you. Let me just adjust the record uh, just slightly. We first thought that our father was born on, uh, in 1930. But digging deeper, records reflect that he was born in 1925. We are grateful to God for choosing him among many to serve the nations of the world preaching the gospel. I now charge us Myself included, everyone in the Obadari family included. That the grace that God gave to our father, the apostle, we should all covet it. Our mother told us a story recently and she repeated it last night. That she was reading. Uh, the scriptures one one evening and when she got to a particular uh, passage uh, our father asked her to stop and repeat that passage she was reading Romans chapter number 15 verse 20 uh, she was stopped at verse 20 and verse 21 Mommy repeated that scripture. Mama toka. And Papa said, please repeat it again. And after several repetitions, Papa said, now the work has started. What does that scripture say? Please let us read it. I endeavor to preach the gospel not in the place where Christ has already been mentioned so that I do not uh, build on somebody else's foundation. That was the key that Papa took from that scripture. That from that moment on, he would endeavor to preach the gospel. But he would go to places where the name of Jesus had not been heard before. So Papa did not give us a a, a mission style of competing with other churches. Papa went to the bush. Papa went to places where others would not want to go. Papa would go where Jesus' name had not been heard. Just from the foundation of this gospel, of this scripture. That's why you will find Wosem in a 
a lot of rural places. Because he was not sent to compete with anybody. The only person we should all compete against is the devil. Don't compare your church with somebody else's church. Just preach the gospel. Let Jesus be honored. And I pray that the grace that was upon the apostle, that that grace shall fall upon each and every one of us. The grace to take the gospel far and wide, that grace will be abundant abundant over our lives. It's not good to just continue to tell the story of Apostle Abadare without the continuous power that was upon the life of that man. So you, you and I must continue to ask, Lord, the power that was upon your servant. Let it come upon me. Let it come upon me. Once you ask for it, it will be granted. So that this ministry can live forever. The ministry of soul winning. Once again, I bow to the Lord God Almighty and to all of you, all of you, all of you, the wonderful work that you're doing. Let's all keep on going. Regardless of God to all generations. And Mama, thank you, Ma. Mama, thank you, Ma. Mama, thank you, Ma. Amen. Amen. So dabaya bio daba. Is it good like this or not? Don't let us wait until somebody die before we start appreciating the person. He that is dead before appreciating him, we don't not even know what we are doing behind him. I will now invite the representative of the sea of the president of Christ's Apostolic Church worldwide for his comment on behalf of the president. Then he will pray for Mama and all of us. After the announcement, I will see uh, Mama E.A. Obadare Children Chapel. Our Lord dedicate here. Let the Lord God do us. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Oda. Yakin Kako Lara, I work on or a council sorting one solid back. I pay Nissan, I pay. I won't go on team one son yet. Let me learn a lesson from what has just been said that I couldn't hear what you are saying very well. I learned a lesson three days ago. As I said, national conference, we just ended that conference at Elayelebukebukun yesterday. But the Reverend Yewade, at the time Bishop Bunye, what power we can, or when you know, me, me fair tell you by. When the Reverends and Bishops came, they had a program that I do, I don't want to follow now. They came, uh, they, uh, yes, that we cannot use a that we cannot use a that we cannot use we that we on wale kokan o on wale kokan o they were they were they were they were meeting oh, me when you ti oluwa se ni ore all those of you that lord god has blessed se de ri anugba la be se ran se yi receive mercy on that so de mo pe o tu ma ri anu olorun gba lo and you know that we come to get e gbe owo yi soke hallelujah me je si oluwa oya o hallelujah 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 Hallelujah! 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 
Mati Joko. Don't sit yet. Wakori Wibe Moko Lono Si Siga. Moko Lono Si Siga. Oh, no, no, Baba, no, 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 me, yeah. Moko Lono Si Siga. Amen. 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 We return all the glory to God this afternoon. The person we cannot even count all the blessings and everything that has done for us. We lift up the glory to the Lord for the grace He has given unto me. To be in this great conference. But you will see me in your sorrow. Uh, you will say amen while I will speak. I for you so receive job alone. Your your focus on the kingdom of God. Lord God, yes. Oh, the son. Amen. Ni oruko awon baba wa are ejo yi. The name of the president of this great mission. Oluswagota ti ojogbon Henry Ojo. Pastor Dr. Henry Ojo. Now put your hands together for Jesus Christ. Put your hands together for Jesus Christ. Yes, a hand for hand for Jesus Christ. Glory to His glory to His comfort to Him. Put your hands together for Jesus. Amen. Amen. Only one King King in your He said, "I should give you individually." Mother, bere King let your dog, Mama, go. And I want to start from a uh, mommy. Mama, Baba, I joy or dog, man, every day when it can pupo pupo. The president of this church, Doctor Henry Ojo, said that to greet you. What the nigga is sort of on your way? I don't see yenny or such yenny. I let you know why you know or my yenny. And he, has me me to... me and he asked me to tell that in the morning it was well with you, in the afternoon it was well with you, and this time that is, you are old is going to be well with you. I'm already, I'm we know your worth. And we know what Lord God has used you to do in the ministry. Now let me give a testimony before I begin to say something. 
2015. Uh, the year 2015, one day. Baba wa, the son and all one fair the father wanted to have a revival at Adamasiba. 2005. No. That he was there for revival. In the committee, in the committee I was there in. Baba, I was lost in the one near Lewi Odo. Now we went to we went to his house around Odosa. I was locked there. I went to put one the for one. And we gave him the gift that we are asked to give unto him. And, I, and I'm, I want, I'm confessing my sins today as I looked at, at Baba. And I said, look at this man. He's not even as, as tall as myself. That's the way I stood beside him. Baba, <laughs> Well, you are, you, are, you are measuring yourself. More than my two mountain on me, I know what you, I know the meaning of what you're doing. I said I didn't do anything. One year or no, so the thing went very for you. So you, your, the thought of your heart is for you to become someone like Obadari. Lord, be Obadari. Go and pray like Obadari. Lord, need what me be Obadari. Go and be holy as Obadari. Lord, need be a yeri to be Obadari. Go and live a holy life like Obadari. At your joy, you're not in the wrong. Let that be. And that day, I head on to this three steps that he made. And I do well, Lord, Lord. And I give thanks to Almighty God. Well, I think that if I bow, what in law? That since our Father has gone away from our midst. The Lord God has said, allow this word to Can you put your hands together for Allah Jesus Christ? The Lord God has not allowed the work to be destroyed. The Lord God has not allowed even the pillar of the church to fall. We return all glory to God. Just wave your hand to the Lord. Just wave your hands unto the Lord. Give him that glory. Give him that glory. Give him the glory. Amen. Amen. Mommy, one time again, I said to give you. You will live very long in Jesus' name. Number two. I'm asked to give all the children that God has given to our father. Bele. Starting from Pastor Dr. Paul Obadari. I have seen that the father left the job for them and they never left it. They went on to it and they are still doing it. And I pray for you, you will do it and get to the kingdom of God. I greet all ye servants of God here present. And you are, thank God that you are succeeding and you are progressing. And I said, I to tell you that the spirit and the physically that you will not be weary. I greet all the elders in the name of, our, of, our, of the president. I greet all the committees and men in the name of the president of the president. I greet all the women in the name of the president of this mission. I greet all the choir in the name of the president of the mission. And I greet all the company that sat together that planned this great conference to come to life. I'm greeting you in the name of the president. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. The Bible tells me the book of Hebrews in the book of Hebrews Hebrews chapter 13 from verse number Hebrews chapter 13 
e baba yen o e ma ro nu opin wa aye won ki e se ma se afara we igbagbo won o ku ese kan jesus christ okan lana ati loni ati titi lai o ti a fi se eko lori ajola yi uh, the topic of the, the theme of this conference is removing all impediments. Mo Removing all your impediments. I don't know whether you believe along with me. The Lord God of Apostles hey, said, you can come back. Do you believe you can come back? I said that God can come back to this mission. Are you saying it's impossible? Please speak loud. Speak loud. It's possible. Oh, check me. Aha. Listen. What the reason why I use that language is this? Do you know that God is looking for, for somebody? <laughs> He's looking for somebody. God is looking for somebody. God is looking for somebody. But the people that God is going to see. And those people whose eyes of the Lord will be upon them. I want to read that one. People are going to receive the hand of God at time. I want to learn my ballo, to my basu se biti bana. And those people that God is going to work with, with the same, the same way He did in the only, the only day. He will remove all their impediments. I thank God when I got here this morning. I met the message a little. What the church has turned to. What it is and, and what the church has turned to in this world. And from the top we are this country has been taking it's not that they have just started, but there has been long that is going on. What is happening in the world today? It has happened in the life of Judah and Israel, Israelis in those days. The trouble the church had today is what have had the churches in those days. I wonder what you know. They knew God before. What did you know about all who are? They had the power of God before. What did you say about it? Now they saw his miracles. What did you know about all They saw the grace. What did you know about all They have seen the power of God. They told me all who what him are. How big God was, they have seen it. But suddenly something came in. And they, dis they deserted God. They put aside the will of God. And they started doing, going on their own way. And the most, the worst of it is that they started worshiping idols. When we got to that point, that verse we used, the Lord made us to understand. He's doing his work. He's doing his work. Look at the way the way what has turned to today. Look at the church of God today. You see the way we are deceiving ourselves and we say we are deceiving God. Look at the way that we have used, we are spending our life in God. Look at the way we are working with God. Look at all the nefarious attitudes in the world. If it happened in the world alone, we say yes, but it's happening right in the church. Of God. At Ibadan? At Ibadan. They call it Oriyomi. They call it it's always broadcasting between 9 and 11. 
apolopo pastor opolopo awon omo olorun ni won gbe wa sori re won de fi asiri igbe aye won and this is it's a shameful thing that even many ministers of god were brought to that place and they begin to expose the secrets of their life and when you now listen to other people's testimonies, by the time you go to 3 or 3 a.m., you will not be able to sleep. Pastor! Pastor! A pastor that is having an affair with a with pastor! A pastor that is having an affair with a with pastor! A pastor that is having a girlfriend in the church, born on 5 or 6. And is doing the work of God. Bi Oluwa o ti fera alaiso dodo ati alaiso tito lati wa mo ba rin lati ba sise I will know how God will now begin to walk with an righteous person and walk with him and begin to work with him Ti awo Olusogun tan ni mo so yan o I'm talking of the pastors of God E wa ja wa awon iwa bage awon iwa buburu ti a fi se ti a fi je ko loro si ninu ojo Olorun loni ta de wo pe bi ati nsin yen na Olorun yo gba be And we now begin to look at the bad habits and the we are watching God today and we say we are thinking that we are doing we are worshiping God God will not take that the reason why God sent Isaiah to the house of Judah is that go kill when them admonish them to put them back to to order do you know that in the CS conference as you're going two things has already happened what about we and now you have been rebuked what a kill of war and you have been warned even in the words of god the way you are supposed to lead your life so that your ways will be right before god i was saying and if you put service that god is going to accept that is your bringing back to come it's now it's now left in your hand for you to be restored is in your hand for you to come back to God is in your hand do you know that even in this uh, can be restored that, that is when you can see God in all things look at what look at look at Look at the number of prayers, the number of vigils, the number of everything we are doing, and yet we have no answer. God is not as wicked as that. God is not as wicked as that. God is not as wicked as that. But the lifestyle of those of us who are calling on God. That they, they have seen a life as a life that they cannot even accept. A life that they can even rot miracles in. Without taking your time. Without taking your time. And I want every one of us that is going to partake in this year's conference that as we go back home, begin to think in your life and examine yourself whether you are still in Go and examine yourself whether we are with God. Amen. Amen. Ah, amen. 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 Let me tell you something. I want you to think about where the world has reached up to this point. And look at the way, think about how you are going to spend your life. And I want some people to understand something. It is good for someone to build a house. It is good for someone to have a car. It's good for someone to have children. It's good for you to have good name. It's it is good for your people to know you to become popular. But the, the journey that you go with God, whilst we are coming, myself and the driver, we came together. We got a place that we had. We went, we, we went far away. The place we are supposed to come in, we, didn't, we missed it. After going far, I that Now we now came back. After coming back, 
Olowa pe o wa pe mi o ni je mo je mo wi pe ona aye niyan mo miss ti mo tun ri bo mi God now told me that it is when you are trying the word that you miss the robot ti mo ri bo mi that you that you see another way out ona jo ba lohun but the way to the king job to miss ye it was you miss it o miss ye forever it is you have you have missed forever Amen. 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 I do tell some pastors in Sacy. My people. If I see a pastor of Sacy that's not get out the kingdom of God, that person is the poorest in the whole world. Listen. I'm about finishing. Be about Los Baptist Church. If you go to Baptist Church, you wait there can one person work for you. They they will not begin to pay you pay you according to your education. Be about Los Anglican Church. You go to Anglican Church, you wait there can one person work for you. They pay you according to your education. Be about Los Anglican Pentecostal Church. You go to other Pentecostal churches. Degree will only one person work. Whatever degree you have is going to be the way they're going to pay you. Are you hearing me? Sorry, man. Is it is it the same thing in CSC? Eh, sorrow. Eh, sorrow. If it is not so, and you are now enduring, and you are enduring, and the only thing that's going to be bad in front of God is that the day you come to God Almighty, and He says, I don't know you, I don't know you, a sinner. It's going to be bad. You see that it's going to be so bitter. A great, a great sorrow will be there. Because you are not why is it that, that we cannot even examine our life and hold on to Jesus Christ and hold on to the cross of God until we get to the kingdom of God? As we are ending this conference this year, you have to go and sit down, go and think. I said that they were all, 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 the, the, all those things that are not good in your life. That, that, that the way of working with God. All my characters that are not belonging to God, God, with which I'm working with God, oh, now we want him only. the way I'm going, me on my door, what is going to be the end? Oh, no, 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 are you, you think I'm going to bring yourself back to position? I spoke yesterday, and in the revival yesterday, do you know, alone, God, only hundred percent. He said, "If you bring one hundred percent, and the devil now says, well, look, I don't need hundred percent. Just give me one percent. I just need one percent of your life. And that's what I need in your life. one percent. Yet it go. That the hundred is not going to take everybody in the world, in the world into the kingdom of hell. Uh, the, you believe in the power of the cross. Believe in the work of the cross. Let that thing you have turned your life and make you out of all these nefarious attitudes and behaviors of your life. All the adulteries of your heart. All the adulteries of your heart. The adulteries in your heart. Have you known that? If you can try it, and you can try and you can fight it with, to overcome what I'm saying, the Lord God is ready to turn back to you, and it's going to bring your life back to you, and you become a, a bona fide child of God. 
There are some people that are not bona fide children of God. And the meaning of the cross for you is for you to become a bona fide child of God. And God and Everybody here present, rise to your feet. Let's stretch forth your hand. What is happening? Stand up on time. Be seated. Are you not Christ upon the church? Because of the the place is living, that is the way they talk there. They say, well, in this place, we don't shout when we pray. Here. Rise to your feet. Stretch for your hand. I will receive mercy. 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 I looked all the time at it. Hey. Now listen to me. Let me say something before we go ahead. Who are you preaching to? What are you preaching on? Do you know the person you are preaching about? What is going to be the end of that person you are preaching to? These are the thinkings of your heart, God. And he saw his pastor. I said, oh, I've seen my pastor here. How oh, will you not forsake me? That is coming to save me. That is coming to save me. They stole, they, they, they kidnapped a church member for six days. Lord, please help me and assist me. And the pastor now. And then they now saw the pastor. And the where they have ah, not kidnapped you know, him. He said, I'm happy, I'm free today. Ah, daddy has come to save me. Come up with daddy, go and no baby. Lord, back here, daddy. You don't want to greet her, daddy. Daddy, uh. Uh. What has caused this? Daddy, what will be 35 minutes or 45 minutes? That, that now, the daddy now held onto a line in nylon. And, and now, as the pastor, please, are we ready to go? He said, Where are you going? He looked at him and then took away his eyes. The way he was crying, they now asked him why he was weeping and lacrimating. What your pastor came here to buy? What your pastor came here to buy? Is we are going to use you to do the same thing to others. So your pastor has come here to buy something. Would like your attention, like. <laughs> Please don't compare ministries and med uh, 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 messages. Uh, not all the glitters. All the glitters is not gold. Pastor there, Dele. And Pastor got home. What that young bad do my Are you not want to pray? 
If God is not behaving the way he's supposed to behave to us, who is guilty? Hey, Whose fault? Mama, you yes, sure. okay. Everyone. It is a fault. The nation that we cannot change. The nation is now shaking us. Why? Whose fault is that? Do you know? I As I had one grace. That he grew up in the house of a king. And he has no has the knowledge. In what is happening in the house of a king? That one has given boldness Let him have been, have been to begin to talk to King. He will say it with boldness and power. Oh, yeah, he knew everything concerning the relationship. He, has. Has. he knows everything in that place. He was, he was being caught with a It was cut into two with a saw. How many servants have got today? How many servants have got today? That has the grace. How many of them are ready to talk to even those that are not, that are not uh, 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 in the spirit of the Lord? Tell them the truth. Because we're looking for money. Because we're looking for aeroplane. Ah, we're now looking for aeroplane. We want to buy jet. We want to be like a church members. Raise, just stretch you for your hand. I said it to say, I shall receive mercy. I will receive mercy. Let us pray for prayers. Every man inside of me, that is going to make me to get lost in the hand of out of me now. By fire, by thunder, out of me now. All the spirits inside of me, that is even going against the will of God, that make that will make me to everything that is working in me. That will be to see God. That spirit that is inside of me, that made him to go and enjoy God. I command you, I do not fire. Oh, shall we do it? Oh, boy, that is bad. You don't want to be here. You don't want to be here. I command you by fire. In the name of Jesus. Oh, out of me, out, 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 out of me, out, out of my body, out, 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 in the name of Jesus, get out of me, go, 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 come out, come out, come out, come out, come out. Go, do say a man, I call like that, guess what, amen. Your word is okay. Raise up your heart, hand. The song I'm going to sing is about the song. Oh, the, an, an old song. The song is this. If the brother is with his glory, you know, for three days ago, you know, that yesterday, not today, if the world is putting me with his glory, there's people who no, there's, there's, there's no oh, danger. They say there's no danger, children of God. I want to say, I used to power to uphold me. Go, Brady, Yank, be aware, it's okay. Raise up your right hand. Everybody, what? Shout out to God. Hey, God, no son. I must not get no. I do want to be a good son. No, I must not get no. Oh, yeah, do I? Shall we play? No, 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 no. Lower, Lua, as so good of Bammy, 
Everybody, raise up your hand. Lord, let me receive mercy. Lord, let me receive mercy. Well, you make you tell God that the person you are standing with. All of you need the mercy of God. You betrothed it. The mercy of God is going to be given. You see that. By the glory by His grace. That God can come to us and we can come to us. 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 Yes, mercy. We can come to us. We can come to us. We can come to us. Oh, do I get la? No, ba. I know that. I know that. Shout for me. Shout for me. Shout for me. Shout for me. Ah. Oh, do I get la? No, ba. Ba ba me get la? No, ba. In the ba, oh, oh, do I get la? No, ba. I know that I'm in the lead. Oh, do I get la? No, ba. Ah, do I get la? No, ba. Ba ba me get la? No, ba. I want all of us to pray these two prayers. Don't, don't 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 bring in pastor don't bring a choir because of the time that won't be, won't be all of us inside this conference room, as the words comes out unto you you will not be shaking all your bodies you will not be shaking all your bodies that what that is also going and coming the warfare that so is going and coming, returning and going and returning. You are not divided into three. That word that is going and coming inside my body. The word that is going and coming back in my house. The word that is going and coming back in my work. Oh, that word is going and coming back in my house. Nino ilemi, oguti lati bo, nino ishari. Eba ina jare, oguti lati bo, nino aguara mi. Oyo, ba no jare, 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 ba by fire, out by fire, out by fire, out by fire, go 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 by fire, out by fire, out, 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 out by fire, 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 out Amen. She a me meta. Ha me ha me a me ni uruko jis. Let's sing this song before we pray the last prayer. Agbara ati ye wa gbe mi fo Agbara ati ye baba mi Agbara ati ye baba mi Agbara ati ye wa gbe mi sare Agbara ati ye wa gbe mi sare 
je wa ko o eya ko rin a jo ko ni o ko bodo wole o agbara ati je baba me agbara ati je wa gbe mi fo agbara ati je baba me agbara ati je wa gbe mi sare oya agbara ati je baba me o ti e le soro agbara ati je wa gbe mi fo agbara Okay, baby. 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 Ok